The Battle of Yaguaje was a decisive victory for the Cuban revolutionaries over the soldiers of the Batista government near the city of Santa Clara in Cuba during the Cuban Revolution. Chapter 1 Background In 1958, Fidel Castro ordered his revolutionary army to go on the offensive against the army of Fulgencio Batista. While Castro led one force against Giza, Mazo and other towns, another major offensive was directed at the capture of the city of Santa Clara, the capital of what was then Las Villas province. Three columns were sent against Santa Clara under the command of Che Guevara, Jaime Viga, and Comilo Cienfuegos. Viga's column was caught in an ambush and completely destroyed. Guevara's column took up positions around Santa Clara. Cienfuegos's column directly attacked a local army garrison at Iagua J. Initially numbering just 60 men out of Castro's hardened corps of 230, Cienfuegos's group had gained many recruits as it crossed the countryside towards Santa Clara, eventually reaching an estimated strength of 450 to 500 fighters. Chapter 2 – The Battle The garrison consisted of some 250 men under the command of a Cuban captain of Chinese ancestry, Alfredo Abon Lee. The attack seems to have started around December 19. Convinced that reinforcements would be sent from Santa Clara, Lee put up a determined defense of his post. The guerrillas repeatedly attempted to overpower Lee and his men, but failed each time. By the 26th of December Comilo Cienfuegos had become quite frustrated, it seemed that Lee could not be overpowered, nor could he be convinced to surrender. In desperation, Cienfuegos tried using a homemade tank against Lee's position. The tank was actually a large tractor encased in iron plates with attached makeshift flamethrowers on top. It, too, proved unsuccessful. Finally, on December 30th, Lee ran out of ammunition and was forced to surrender his force to the guerrillas. Chapter 3 Aftermath The surrender of the garrison was a major blow to the defenders of the provincial capital of Santa Clara. The next day, the combined forces of Cienfuegos, Guevara, and local revolutionaries under William Alexander Morgan captured the city in a fight of vast confusion. Panicked by news of the defeat at Santa Clara and other losses, Batista fled Cuba the next day.